नमस्ते एंड गुड मॉर्निंग डियर किड्स टुडे वी विल स्टडी अबाउट प्रेपोजिशंस डियर किड्स प्रेपोजिशंस में एक वर्ड है पोजिशंस सो वॉट आर प्रेपोजिशंस प्रेपोजिशंस आर द वर्ड्स विच हेल्पर्स टू टेल अबाउट पोजिशन और लोकेशन ऑफ समथिंग फॉर एग्जाम्पल माई फोन इज ऑन द टेबल so here they are telling where is my phone what is the position of my phone my phone is on the table yani table ke upar prepositions that we will study today are on over in under and behind on on matlab upar means when something is kept ऑन अदर थिंग इन अ वे दैट द सर्फेस इज टचिंग यानी जब एक चीज़ दूसरे चीज़ के ऊपर रखी जाती है इस तरीके से कि उनके सर्फेस एक दूसरे से टच कर रहे हों सो इन दैट केस वी यूज ऑन सो लेट्स सी फ्यू एग्जाम्पल्स द बुक इज ऑन द टेबल इन पिक्चर वन यू कैन सी द बुक इज ऑन द टेबल इन द सेकेंड पिक्चर वेर इज एन एप्पल Yes, an apple is on the book. Next is over. Over means children. When something is above something, and also it is not touching. Yani koi chiz jab dusri chiz ke upper hai aur wo touch nahi kar rahi hai. Let's see an example. The rat is jumping. over the paper roll you can see in the picture the rat is not touching the paper roll it is just jumping over it so the rat is jumping over the paper roll in the second picture we can see a aeroplane we can see clouds and are they touching no and plane is above the clouds so we'll say the aeroplane is flying over the clouds dear kids over is also used when we talk about covering something jab kisi cheez ko dhakne ki hum baat karte hain tab bhi hum kiska use karte hain over for example he is putting a blanket over the baby but in this case blanket is touching the baby no that's why i told you that over is also used when we talk about covering something for example he is putting a blanket over the baby next under under matlab niche when something is below something else yani jab kuch koi cheez kisi dusri cheez ke niche hoti hai we use under for example in the first picture where is the key yes the key is under the mat in the first picture where is the key yes the key is under the mat in the second picture where is the toy yes dear children the toy is under the chair next is in in matlab me ya under dear kids in we use when we talk about some place and also when we talk about something being kept inside the other thing for example if i tell you one example about place so i am in goa yani main kahan hu main goa mein hu so when we talk about place we use in let's see other examples where is the book in the first picture yes book kahan hai bag ke andar hai the book is in the bag in the second picture where is the apple yes apple kahan hai basket ke andar hai so the apple is in the basket next behind behind matlab piche that means at back of something now let's take few examples where is the boy in the first picture yes the boy is behind the chair yani boy kahan hai chair ke piche hai in the second picture where is the cow the cow is behind the fence now we will do one exercise given on page number 66 of your textbook look at the picture and complete the sentences pick the right word from the box and the words are in on under behind over 
So let's observe the first picture. We can see a cat which is trying to jump. The sentence is the cat is jumping dash the wall. So the answer will be the cat is jumping over the wall. Here the cat is not touching the wall. It is not sitting on the wall. It is just jumping over it. Next the cat is dash the box. Yes, correct. The cat is in the box. Next, we can see a cat trying to hide herself. So, the cat is dash the door. The cat is behind the door. Cat kaha hai? Darwaze ke piche. Next, we can see a cat sitting. Yes, the cat is dash the stool. Kaha par hai cat? The cat is under the stool. Yani stool ke niche hai. Next, the cat is dash on the suitcase. Observe the picture and tell me. Yes, the cat is on the suitcase. So, this was all for today. Goodbye, dear kids.